Also, an owl found tangled and in trouble at Everglades National Park. Thankfully, a visitor who frequently goes to the park came across the, the owl that was stuck and struggling. And he knew exactly who to call, and he did so quickly. Seven's Franklin White has this exclusive. This is the first time I've ever seen an animal caught in, in a, something like that. 70 year old Lester Shalloway didn't know his normal day in Shark Valley at Everglades National Park Sunday would be the day he helped to save a life. It was wrapped, I don't know how many times around the wing, and it was just stuck between a branch on top. And it just, the bird just couldn't untangle it. And it wasn't just any bird, it was an owl that he says was stuck and struggling to free itself from a fishing line. I was talking to the ranger, they told me that a lot of people, it's illegal to fish in the parks, but they'll go in at night, walk up the trail and fish. Guy probably cast it across the little pond and caught it in the tree and just cut the line and left it there. There was a lot of line all over the place. Park rangers say the bird must have been coming in for a landing and didn't see the fishing line. But thanks to Lester, the bird's frightening moments didn't last long. And I took a good picture of it, went over to the ranger station, showed them the picture, and then they came out with a kayak and went to rescue it. After about 30 minutes, the owl was free. And if it wasn't for Lester's quick thinking, this outcome may have ended a lot differently seemed to be in good shape. In fact, after she freed it, she was trying to take it in to um, inspect it, and it, it just flew away. It pushed itself out from the canvas she had it under and flew away. So it's in good shape. Franklin White, Today in Florida. And so according to the park rangers there, that owl appeared to not be injured.